Battle leaves as the all-time leading scorer at Penn State. is 2,213 points, the 11th best total in Big Ten history. Also first in career starts for the Nittany Lions, third in assists, first player in Big Ten history with more than 2,000 points, 500 assists, and 500 rebounds. Tough way for his season, his career to come to an end, but what's your takeaway from this Penn State season? But Dave, if you think about it, this, this crew was really made up of five players. You know, Jackson, Brooks, Jones, Frazier, and also Battle. You know, nothing going away from Woodyard and Marshall, but that team kind of rallied around each other. They fought through adversity. When they had to win games, Illinois at home, Wisconsin at home, Michigan State, they won those games. When it got time for them to kind of hunker in and really focus in at the Big Ten tournament to win three games, they did that. They proved a lot about this team that, you know, we may not get the recognition, we may not have the names, but we play hard, we know how to play. So for them to get to the tournament final, for those, experience, those seniors to experience what they were able to do, it says a lot about the character, not only the coaching staff, but these young men and their family. And I'm so happy that all of them had a chance to experience, even if it was just for one game. It was neat to see them out there. And Ed DeCellis, who is such a great guy, you know, this is a yeah. team 11 and 20, Last year, I don't think a lot of people thought this year would end mm -hmm. with an NCAA tourney bid. They get there for just the third time since 1965. So a great season, certainly, for the Nittany Lions.